Greetings again, everybody. Uh, thank you for being with us today. It's Wednesday, and it's a good day today. It's supposed to be uh, really warm weather, and uh, you can just sense a tide is turning. Uh, you know, the robins are out, the spring is near, and we're getting closer and closer to being out of uh, this pandemic. It's uh, just been just been, uh, it's it's good time right now. And so uh, today we, we uh, launch back into our daily Psalms for Hope and we're back to Psalm number one. And so uh, get out your Bibles and uh, let's look at this again and see what the psalmist has to say. It says, Blessed is the man who walks not in the counsel of the wicked, nor stands in the way of sinners, nor sits in the seat of scoffers, but his delight is in the law of the Lord, and on his law he meditates day and night. He is like a tree planted by streams of water that yields its fruit in its season, and its leaf does not wither. In all that he does he prospers. The wicked are not so, but are like chaff that the wind drives away. Therefore the wicked will not stand in the judgment, nor sinners in the congregation of the righteous. For the Lord knows the way of the righteous, but the way of the wicked will perish. And what I like about this psalm is the fact that uh, it really shows us the, the value of being in God's word, uh, having God's word as a part of your daily life. Uh, we are kind you know, he says here, we are like a tree planted by streams of water that yields its fruit and its, season, and its leaf does not wither. And all that he does prospers. It's not a, it's not a prospering like a, a material prospering because we all know that that's not true. There are times in our lives where we do have seasons of, of trials and tribulations. Uh, so, it, it's, not, it's not that more than it is the spiritual uh, blessing, the, the spiritual blessing of, uh, uh, of being in God's word because that is our refuge and that is our strength. Uh, the person who dwells in the word is like a tree planted by the streams of water where they're being refreshed. And you see, this is, this is what is so valuable about doing something like this, is that we're in the Word, we're, we're being you know, encouraged by it. Uh, what I value uh, is that you know, when you're in the Word with someone or when you're in the Word with your, by yourself, there is, there is encouragement. Uh, that comes from it. There are things that you learn. There are things that you understand uh, differently, perhaps, when you meditate on God's Word, when you kind of look at the words and just see how they apply to your life. Uh, there's something valuable about that. And that's what he means by, you know, being like a tree planted by streams of water. There's a refreshing uh, that comes with that. And that is, uh, that is where we prosper uh, spiritually because when those trials do come, when, when, the, uh, when the hardships happen, we, we, we just go through them differently uh, because of the strength that we have in God's promises and, and God's grace through his word. And so um, value being in his word. At some point, these psalms, the daily psalms for hope, are going to end. Uh, I, get the, I get the feeling, you know, we're coming up on a year, and we'll, we'll kind of take some time to review that once it happens. But uh, at some point, uh, I kind of get the picture of, uh, of uh, Forrest Gump when he's, when he's running, He's just running. He's just running and running and he can't and he doesn't stop running. He just keeps running and keeps running. And then all of a sudden he just stops. And I think that's what's going to happen with this. But 
what, what I'm hoping to get out of this, what I'm hoping you get out of this, is that there is value in being in this word. As we have seen through these 150 Psalms, there is value that we can pick up just by reading it and understanding it and, and focusing on it uh, because it does speak different things to us. I mean, we've been through these a couple of times now and, uh, you know, verse one, or chapter one is, you know, there's something a little different than what we picked up the first time we read it. Uh, but that's the value of God's word. And that's why he says we're like a tree planted by streams of water, yielding its fruit in its season, and its leaf does not wither. Uh, because the strength and the power that we have to live in this life, to live through any circumstances we find ourselves in, comes through him and what he can say to us in his word. So may God's blessings be upon you this day and value your time in the Word whenever and wherever you can uh, because it is your strength and it is uh, this, the, the, the refreshing uh, that you will get uh, in your life. So God's blessings and see you the next time.